Hi guys, welcome to the channel. Quick general updating for my friends Cancer, Sun, Moon, Rising and Venus. Whenever you watch this, take what resonates and leave what doesn't. If you resonate, let us know, like, share and subscribe to the channel. Thank you for the support. So guys, let's find out what messages want to come through for you. Cancer, Sun, Moon, Rising and Venus in the Love Arena. Let's see what we can get for you guys. Alright, and I guess that we have two cards already, so we are good to go. You get Mending and Higher Power. A combination that, um, for me, speaks volume about the opportunity to get in touch with your higher self in order to heal your soul, your mind, your body, because maybe something in the past mm, may have been harsh, you know, some experience uh, that didn't go in a way that was a source of satisfaction, but then it was some kind of chance to ignite uh, a spark within you in order to raise your awareness some kind of uh, divine opportunity maybe in the most classical uh, blessing in disguise this is a very powerful opportunity indeed so let's go and see what the tarot has to say about this combination for cancer sun moon rising in venus Mending for me is always uh, an oracle guidance that speaks about healing, taking a moment for yourself, nurturing yourself, your energies, in order to regroup and recharge. Here we go. Seven of Wands, Ace of Cups, King of Swords. Four of Cups, bottom of the deck. I feel that this is a meaningful energy about the past, just like the Seven of Wands, meaning that something has brought you to a decision, a conclusion, in order for you to change your ways, basically, and start doing things in a even slightly different um, way compared to the one that you may have applied before. You know, the Four of Cups always gets the meaning about uh, someone that is closed off and may risk to miss a very meaningful opportunity, you know. But the opportunity will come and I feel that some of you guys, those that uh, may resonate with this um, flow of energies, um, may be ready for it. Because we have a meaningful King of Swords energy, you know, which is about a very clear mind and the ability to speak your truth, speak in a clear way about the things that you want to pursue, the things that you desire, but also the things that you are willing to share and the ones that you do not want to experience again in your journey. That's why the seven of ones can go to ways, meaning about something in the past that has caused for you to stand up and tall in order to defend yourself in this case from external factors you know the ones that are in front of these very brave men but at the same time this is an energy that some of you may bring to the table moving forward paired with the king of swords so a defensive stand in order to protect what has value for you because you feel that 
this is the way to call in Ace of Cups energy, which is first and foremost self-love, the ability to nurture your yourself, your body, your mind, your soul, being loving and caring, but at the same time the, the chance for a new beginning in love full of deep feelings a fair opportunity to experience a love partnership that can be fulfilling and we have the star bottom of the four of cups so truly the opportunity kind of divinely guided with the star which is wish fulfillment and healing also so this is meaningful Let's go and clarify this combination, guys. Let's see what we can get about it. King of Swords, very practical mind, seeing things in a, in a way that uh, doesn't allow um, any misunderstanding to uh, be in the way, you know. Page of Wands, Two of Wands, King of Swords, which is beautiful. And the star comes back. So, indeed, um, a fated opportunity for some of you to completely change the landscape that you may have been involved with before. I will keep the star here with me because the Two of Wands for me is a soulful decision you know an energy that can be an influence for the following chapters of the journey the man is brave because he is holding the world in his hand so basically his life you know evaluating all the aspects all the factors that may be crucial for him in order to make the best possible decision crossroads a uh, card the two of ones also this is this this is the decision to pursue again a fair opportunity in love which as always starts within you with the approach that comes from within and again i feel that uh, past experiences have played um meaningful role in this development this is a powerful inner growth because the king of swords finds uh, again the same energy meaning that you have raised your level even of knowledge for example because the king of swords is very sharp you know in managing all the informations all the knowledge that um, he may have at his disposal but again there is a, a touch of a very clear mind in order to be able to avoid the things that may have been disappoint disappointing uh, for you in the past the page of ones is interesting because it's always um, a teeny tiny bit of passion that can be ignited um, at a certain point in time the the fact with this combination is about the moving forward because you may experience or some of you guys may experience a seven ones uh, approach towards new opportunities um, especially in the very early stages coming out from the um, previous chapter and the healing phase you know the mending phase you will be careful with the interactions that uh, you may find along uh, your way very selective is also the word that is coming to my mind um, because you have matured basically this king of swords uh, way of seeing things but 
the page one again is a sincere loving and humble gesture it may be a token of communication a message some kind of offer you know the drill right this is a, a spark of passion that can be instilled again in your journey by a person that you may discover as very different from those that um, you may have interacted with before in love connections and maybe truly the chance to achieve a wish fulfillment we have seen twice the star so the chance for healing and a wish granted that can see the ace of cups energy as a main factor uh, main theme of the following chapters in order for you to heal properly even uh, possible disappointments past related so this is very auspicious maybe it is a process for those of you that may resonate with these energies but you have sharpened your mind basically and the follow and the rest will follow i'm sorry um, guided in some way in order for you to experience um fulfillment that you deserve so guys quite a flow of energies i will leave it at that i truly hope it was helpful i'll continue on vimeo see you there if you want to join me the link is below let us know if you resonate leave a comment like share and subscribe to the channel until next time i wish you the best guys take very good care of you and i will talk to you soon bye